Over the past several years, the Virginia General Assembly has supported the development of Profile of a Virginia Graduate. The profile identifies the knowledge and skills that students should practice and demonstrate during high school in order to be a successful contributor to the community. These skills, also known as the five C's, include critical thinking, creative thinking, collaboration, communication, and citizenship. The profile was developed to describe the knowledge, skills, competencies, and experiences students should attain during their K-12 education to become life ready. It presents and describes four overlapping areas for student learning and achievement considered for success beyond high school. Content knowledge, workplace skills, career exploration, community engagement, and civic responsibility. Fauquier County Public Schools will partner with our students and their families, our faculty and staff, and our community to develop and implement innovative schedules, programs, and opportunities to cultivate the potential for each learner in the pursuit of developing creative, confident, knowledgeable, and globally competitive graduates. We invite you to join us as we follow three Fauquier County Public School students for a day of school. Through this tour of a profile of a Fauquier graduate, our goal is to introduce you to the experiences our students are participating in that will prepare them for the next chapter of their lives. We will follow Wanye, Sarah, and Lucas as they each experience their typical day. The learning experiences featured serve as a sampling of the experiences currently offered to our students. We'll first join Wanye, a senior at Kettle Run High School, as he captures and documents a story for his photojournalism class. His work will be published in the school's yearbook and read by an authentic audience of his peers. Through photojournalism, Wanye has honed skills in writing, proofreading, page design, photography, marketing, and theme development. These happen to be many of the same skills he will apply later in the day as an intern for Remax Regency. Wanye spends the rest of the morning in sociology class. Students enrolled in this course examine topics such as delinquency, crime, chemical addiction, and poverty. Through this course, students collaborate and apply their learning in an effort to find solutions to real-world issues. Today, Wanye participates in a class discussion about spectator violence in sports. After class, Wanye catches up with his friends on his way to lunch. Sarah and her family moved to Fauquier County during her seventh grade year after living in several other countries. She begins her day at Liberty High School in an elective capstone course. This course is offered to students as a culminating experience in history and social science. Students discuss world geopolitical events while practicing skills such as research writing and crafting debate through problem-based learning. To extend her interest in international affairs, Sarah spends her next block in an independent study. This opportunity has provided Sarah ways to design, along with her teacher, a course of study that allows her to dive deeper into her research topic of the Arab Spring. Today, Sarah is joining a fellow student, Nada, to present to a class of sophomores about Islam and the culture of the Middle East from personal experience. While students listened to the presentation, they were able to ask questions of Sarah and Nada. As we join Lucas at Fauquier High School, he is starting his morning at the Fauquier Environmental Studies Academy. Freshman year poses no hurdle for Lucas because he tackles new situations with enthusiasm and confidence. This academy, one of three existing in Fauquier, opened in 2017 as a way to let students focus their interest in learning more about environmental science, including authentic field experiences. Lucas is currently taking environmental geology, and today he and his classmates are working together on a meteorite lab to measure the diameter of impact craters on the moon's surface. After this class, Lucas continues his day in health and PE. Today, he enjoys teaming up with his classmates and getting some physical activity into his day. We rejoin Wanye as he has finished eating his lunch. Through his work as an intern, Wanye has cultivated leadership and public speaking skills. Today he is practicing those skills while sharing with others about his internship experience, all in a recruitment effort. As a real estate intern, Wanye creates marketing materials and assists new agents with managing their social media accounts and launching their websites. Wanye is currently taking classes to earn his real estate license. He plans to become an agent after high school and looks forward to building a successful real estate career. Sarah starts her afternoon in her elementary functions class. Here Sarah is involved in practicing higher level math that she will need in college. 
her teacher is facilitating review of homework problems that students have identified that they would like to solve together. Sarah next travels from Liberty High School in Bealton to Warrington where she is an intern at the Department of Social Services. Here, Sarah, as part of the internship program, is working on her project for the term, exploring how people from various cultures experience the services offered. This week, Sarah is also helping the department prepare for an event they are hosting along with Taylor Middle School students to raise awareness for domestic violence. Their efforts also include students who are part of the Warrenton Youth Council and from Falkir High School. This culminating event idea from students is just one way our students have opportunities to give back to their communities. After her internship, Sarah will return to Liberty as a sports medicine trainer. Under the guidance of the athletic trainer, Sarah will help prepare athletes for their upcoming match. Tonight's game is a pink out to support and raise funds for breast cancer research. The Eagles are hosting the Cougars. We find Lucas this afternoon in his theater class. Through this course, students have recently worked to draft scene designs, engage in monologues, character analysis, author intent discussions, and have been practicing acting scenes. Today, Lucas and his classmates receive final directions from their teacher as they help prepare for the upcoming production, The Glass Menagerie. After school, Lucas spends his time on the football field. As a team manager, Lucas helps the Falcons varsity football team prepare for their upcoming Friday night game by taking care of the team's equipment needs and assisting with field preparations. As you've seen by following Wanye, Sarah, and Lucas, FCPS is committed to evolving our instructional practices to better meet the needs of all learners and better prepare our graduates for their futures. Our students will need to demonstrate skills that will allow them to navigate a quickly changing world and economy. There are multiple pathways our students may choose to follow to be successful. And as one team, we will be sure they are ready.